Zach Fernandez. I'm wide receiver for Holy Cross, and I'm going to sign for Oklahoma Panhandle State University for football. I went up there to visit, and it seemed like a lot like Holy Cross. All the guys were real close. Since it's in the middle of nowhere, you kind of have to be close with your friends. So it seemed, reminded me of Holy Cross, so I picked that school. It feels great. I've done a lot of this for my mom now, because my, my dad passed away at the beginning of the year. so. It's mostly all for my mom. My friends have been great support. Everyone has made a strong connection, and I love every single one of you. And I couldn't ask for better friends, and I hope to meet someday back at Holy Cross. Good morning. Welcome to Holy Cross of San Antonio. I'd like to welcome the family of Zach Fernandez, senior here at Holy Cross of San Antonio. It's a special day for Zach and his family as he signs a letter of intent to play college football at Oklahoma Panhandle State University. Zach, we're very proud of you. You've brought a lot of special moments to Holy Cross of San Antonio, and we wish you the best. We know you'll not be wearing the Holy Cross colors next year, but always remember that once a night, always a night. Congratulations, Zach. At this time, I'd like to introduce our head football coach and athletic director, Coach Mike Harrison. Thank you, Mr. Galindo. Zach, we're all very proud of what you've accomplished in your career here at Holy Cross. You are an inspiration to us all in the effort that you have given, in, not just on the football field, but how you've grown as a student and as a man. We ask, Zach, that when you go to Oklahoma Panhandle State, that you remember the lessons you learned here, and that you carry those lessons with you the rest of your life, and that you exemplify what it means to be a true Holy Cross man. All right, Zach, it's time to do it. Let's open up that folder. Let's put our name on that letter of intent and get ready to play a little college football for the Oklahoma Panhandle State Aggies. Congratulations. Well, today we uh, have the pleasure of signing another one of our senior football players to a letter of intent to play f college football at Oklahoma Panhandle State University. Zach has done so many things. He's punted for us. He's caught a tremendous amount of touchdown passes. Just an outstanding athlete. And not only that, but a great young man who's going to represent himself, his family, and Holy Cross of San Antonio in outstanding fashion. Um, this is the best day of my life, his life, um, for him to be moving on from high school. He had a great education. He loves it here at Holy Cross. And now we look forward to him moving on to the next chapter of his life, playing football at OPSU. Um, I couldn't ask for more. Uh, hopefully go to Oklahoma Panel State, get my associates in a fi as a fireman, and then move on to my bachelor's as a four-year. And hopefully... I won't redshirt my freshman year and I get to start, so that's what I'm looking forward to. Well, Zach's been a, a, a true Holy Cross Knight since the time he was a freshman. Very talented individual. Probably the thing I'm most proud about Zach is the fact that he's become a better student and a better man through the process. I mean, he always had talent athletically, but we were always hoping that he would rise to reach a full potential academically and athletically. He's got a big heart. You know, he's had a, a rough year this year with his dad passing away. So it's been, it's been real hard and, you know, he's coming out, out of his shell a little bit more as time goes on without his dad. But um, as far as helping people, he just uh, he'll do anything for anybody. He knew that his father wanted him to continue to play football. Zach never missed a workout. He came out, he became a leader, became an inspiration to the team and uh, gained a lot of respect from all of us. This group of boys, they've been together since seventh grade. So, you know, they know each other like the back of their hand. They know their families, their parents. I mean, it's just a close-knit family, and he just, he's the only child, so him being here, he's got 70 other brothers that, you know, are just like brother, real brothers. And I'm just glad that he's a part of Holy Cross and the Holy Cross family. 
probably the most significant thing for us is the fact I think we preach family, family first. We are going to become a family-oriented school. Part of that feeds into the team motif or the team idea that we have, and that in itself lends it to success. One of the great uh, analogies was by Michael Jordan. Michael Jordan said, you can have great individuals, but until you learn to play together as a team, it's only then that the, true, the individuals can realize the honors and the things they want. I think that's a good example right here. Um, great group of athletes played together as a team, and now they're kind of reaping those rewards. I'm going to miss my friends, my family, the faculty, teachers, of course. My coach, Coach Harrison's been a lot to me. My coach Libby, he's done a lot. Took me up to Oklahoma Penn Hill State for my first visit, and just going to miss all this the family. I think I would tell Zach that we're very proud of him. We wish him well. Continue to do what he's done here at Holy Cross. His Holy Cross education will serve him well, and we uh, will keep our eye on him always. Take the lessons you've learned here, carry them with you the rest of your life, and if you do that, you're going to be a success. I'm looking forward to going to Oklahoma Panhandle State to play football. Hopefully I can show him my talent.